All right, guys, so today I'm going to be working on the water wheel. Um, I have a whole bunch of 2x4s here, um, and I got my tools, and I have this little drawing I made, um, and I have all the dimensions I need. So today I'm going to be cut. Uh, I'm going to be marking those dimensions and then cutting them. Uh, so I'll have a time lapse for that. Okay, so what I'm doing here is I took all eight of the intermediate spokes that fit into the 90 degree um, corner in between the cross axles, and what I'm doing is I'm just using a speed square to mark um, 45 degree angles, which is basically going to turn the edge of each of these into an arrow so that they fit perfectly into that 90 degree angle that those cross spokes make. So that's what I'm doing here. After that, I'll use the miter saw to cut them, and we'll have our finished product. Alright, so after a lot of work with drawing the lines and cutting them, um, I have this set up. So we have all the 2x4s cut to what they need to be and roughly assembled. This isn't perfect, it's not lined up perfectly with the midpoint of the, the long center pieces, center axles. Um, but I have mo most everything, it's all cut, um, it's all all set up so now I'm going to get to gluing these cross these, these cross axles cross spokes whatever you want to call them together So what I'm doing now is I have um, two 10-foot sections of 2x4s, and I'm basically marking out um, six 15-inch segments um, off of these strips of 2x6s. These cut pieces will actually act as a way to connect the regular cross spokes and the intermediate spokes together in the final product. I'm now cutting those segments of 2x6s, um, again there's 16 of them. This is the first straight cut and then after that we're going to be cutting a 22.5 degree angle into them. Okay, now that those are cut, I'm going to the 22 and a half degree angle um, and basically cutting these 
into their segments. Two of these I actually unfortunately messed up, I cut the wrong angle, so in the final product you will see that we are two, two um, of these pieces short. However, next next week when I get more wood, um, I'll, I'll build those next two pieces. So it's, it's not that big of a deal, but it was an unfortunate mistake. Okay, so this is the final um, product. None of these, uh, the intermediate spokes and the um, little connectors, the ones that I just made, none of those are actually nailed in yet. That we'll get, be getting into in part two of this video. So stay tuned. It should be coming out either next week or the week after that. Um, and by then we should have it um, nearly or completely finished. So stay tuned and I'll see you in the next video.